Hello, this is Nick with NicksComputerFix.com and here's a video on how to download Windows 10's update and install Windows 10's 2020 update 2004. Alright, let's go ahead and get started. First of all, let me go down to my start menu and right click and go up and click on system so I can show you what version of Windows 10 I'm upgrading from and that happens to be the Windows 10 Home version 1909 and that's the old version the latest version that was just released in May um, late May is 2004 alright let me go ahead and close this out and let's begin the update process of upgrading this computer from 1909 to 2004 by going into settings here and once Windows settings window is open go ahead and click on the last category update and security and that opens up the Windows update window now if Microsoft has determined that the feature update is available for your computer you'll see it right here as you see mine is available the 2004 update and if I want it to I can go ahead and click on download and install and you can do the same if you see it here if you don't go ahead and click on check for updates and it'll go out and see if Microsoft has determined that um, the latest update which is 2004 is available for you or not and if it is you will see it down here if you don't see it down here then there's a really easy way to go about um, installing the latest version for your computer so let's go ahead and close this out and I'll show you how to go about doing that and what we want to go ahead and do is open up an internet browser I'm opening up Firefox because I like Firefox and uh, you can open up Chrome or Microsoft Edge or whatever you like to open up and use once you have it open go ahead and go to Google that's my favorite search engine and type in these words Windows 10 download and I'm gonna go ahead and paste it from my clipboard because I've done this a couple of times and once you do type that in go ahead and click on Google search and that'll bring up some potential URL or links that you can click on now if you scroll down the one that I recommend that you click on is this one right here uh, let me get up here download Windows 10 disk image ISO file Microsoft so go ahead and click on that one and when you do that brings up the download Windows 10 window and you know this URL here um, I'm going to go ahead and put that in the, the description of this video for you for your convenience now you can go ahead and click on update now or you could go down here and click on download tool now I suggest and recommend that you click on the first one here update now for the Windows 10 May 2020 update which will update your computer um, that you're presently um, using and you'll get this save file I'm gonna go ahead and save this because it's downloading to my computer and I've saved it and I'll click on the download arrow here and then I'll click on the Windows 10 upgrade exe file there and that will give me my very first prompt um, update to the latest version of Windows 10 and uh, it tells me it's one of the best features of Windows 10 is that it keeps getting better and better and better okay um, I went ahead and clicked on update now and congratulations this PC is compatible CPU memory and disk space all three of those check out good and if I wanted to I can go ahead and minimize this or sit here and watch this getting your update ready and it's downloading the Windows 10 update please wait and you know I speed this up by uh, the video editor here that I'm using however this could take up to a good 30 minutes or even an hour to download and then once it's finished downloading it verifies the download process and then it starts updating my Windows 10 and 
and it gives me a percentage of completeness and again I've speed this up so this is moving really quick for this video once it's completed I get your update is ready and gives me 30 minutes it's going to restart my computer and I allowed this to go ahead and restart on its own and it gives me this last message you're about to be signed out and uh, gives me an opportunity to um, you know click on close and uh, if I want it to if not it restarts and it can restart a couple of times and then it installs Windows 10's feature update for May the uh, version 2004 and you get this message here welcome back here are some tips to help you get started one two three see how choose them and get started and you can check those out if you like I'll go ahead and close that out for now and go down to the start menu here and I'll right click and then click on system and that takes me to the Windows 10 about information page and I'll go down here and show you that I am still on Windows 10 home but I have the latest version 2004 feature update now installed on this computer here okay we have come to the end of this video let me go ahead and close this out thanks for watching subscribe if you like and leave a like if you like and remember to share